Hello and welcome to Sports Vibe TV. Today we're down at the Lee Valley Athletic Centre and I'm pleased to say I'm here with Charles Eugster. Charles, welcome. 95 years old, known as one of the fittest pensioners in the world, but also one of the Don't fastest. Don't believe it. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of the fastest as well, I've heard. You're competing here on Saturday. Are you um, going to be smashing any more world records? Uh, not. Not world. I've got an shall we say, an eye on the European and uh, a couple of national records. 95, fitter than you've ever been, would you say? You've worked very hard at an age that not many people are even, you know, exercising, let alone sprinting round tracks like we've just seen from you. <laughs> well, um, the idea is that uh, I want to... I want to change the world. You see, I want to. I want to make. Uh, I want to make uh, old age something wonderful, stupendous, glorious, fantastic, superb, interesting, exciting. I want to make old age the best part of one's life. So, eighty-seven, you started bodybuilding. I started bodybuilding. Yes, so, so, simply because uh, I was very vain. And I noticed that my body had deteriorated and I wanted to uh, improve my appearance. And so I joined a bodybuilding club. I also employed a previous Mr. Universe as my personal trainer. And uh, he trained me for two years. And uh, moving on, what message would you give to other people, perhaps retiring now? Oh Once no, re fit and healthy. Re retirement, retirement is a health catastrophe and a financial disaster. Uh, any, anybody that retires is putting one foot into a chamber of horrors. Because it's, um, in my opinion, uh, work is the most important thing uh, for a healthy old age. Number one is work, number two is nutrition, and number three is exercise in that order. And if you want an example, all you have to do is to look at the Queen, who is 87 and who manages an enormous schedule, and she is not somebody, as far as I know, that uh, goes running in Buckingham Palace Park, but she has a job and she does her job magnificently and she is in, in good health. It is work that is the most important and the most neglected aspect of aging. Absolutely, and just finally, you've achieved so much and you keep on achieving things into your 90s. Is there anything else you'd really love to achieve that you haven't yet? Well, I'd like to, I'd like to have a new girlfriend. <laughs> You're gonna keep up the bodybuilding then? <laughs> oh, of course. And uh, well, um, trying to uh, Im improve, my, improve my sprinting uh, because it's something new, it's something that I've never done before in my life. I was never a sprinter, I was hopeless at, at, at running. And, uh, but um, I'd like to show that one can uh, learn uh, something new at any age in life. And that's the uh, importance about the retirement age. You don't have to uh, continue doing the job you're doing. You can, you can start something new. In fact, you can start something new at any age. Absolutely. Charles, it's been an absolute pleasure to meet you and thanks Delighted. very much for joining us. Delighted to be here. Thank, Thank you. you.